good afternoon sir ha ah, good afternoon mr rajesh congratulations on securing all india rank 10 with electronics and telecommunication and in engineering sir exam 2023 we are Thank proud you. to say that you are an online live batch student and various other guidances please briefly introduce yourself sir i am rajesh tiwari i am from lalitpur uttar pradesh i did my graduation from nit trichy in 2018 after that i worked uh, in private sector through my campus placement in target corporation india mm-hmm. till 2022 during covid time i have decided to apply for esc exam so mm-hmm. in 2022 i wrote uh, esc exam but i was not able to clear the uh, interview part Okay. so after that i resigned from my job and then i prepared uh, for 7 8 months acha full time you prepared for engineering yes, yes and no i was working as a freelancer in one of the us firm so i was working also but in freelancing job i was getting more time to prepare okay, okay. so coming to the preliminary part yes sir so what was your uh, uh, preparation strategy or technique for general studies and uh, technical paper sir so technical paper is same for prelims and mains but uh, for general study part uh, i was more focused on math and aptitude part because uh, we are engineers so we are good in that so mm-hmm. uh, most of the score i get from math and aptitude and other subject i prepared but not thoroughly current affair part i skipped and then uh, some 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 uh, subjects were there which were scoring like engineering design and drawing like they mm-hmm. have a static type of questions material mm-hmm. science is kind of random for electronics and communication person because that is more of mechanical and civil oriented questions so that mm-hmm. also i skipped for uh, uh, prelims par other than that i have prepared most of the questions of uh, in the technical paper 150 objective questions and 3 hours duration yes sir how you managed the time sir for time management mostly i try with uh, mostly in a, in in, a, in electronics and communication network questions are easy so that okay. is my go to thing like wherever i will find network question i will solve those questions first like this i have selected some subjects like i will start with these uh, these subjects and then i will uh, jump to uh, other subjects and in that way i have planned my uh, exam always but generally it takes time to identify the questions of a particular subject na uh, sir mostly what happens is they will ask around a uh, eight to nine question in a sequence for net well that's okay. what pattern i am noticing so they okay. they will be in sequence i just have to find that sequence like from 80 to 90 it is there or 90 to 100 it is there that okay. much uh, yeah yeah got like it going got only it. one time only you will understand where this subject yeah, question yeah, because yeah. some question are time taking and if you stuck on that it will waste so much of your time okay. and uh, so yeah. you focused on the subjects you are very much interested in yes yeah. yes 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 okay. and uh, have you followed any elimination techniques no sir i didn't follow no elimination mm-hmm. so then how you have taken care of the negative marking in case of a wrong answer sir most of the thing in technical paper i have miss in my previous experience i had accuracy of around 80 to 90% like if i am doing that question that miss i tried my best to not do calculation mistake or anything and for general study part also i i, I will not attempt uh, so much question whichever i am sure because upsc will always confuse you they will yes. give that uh, yes so putting blind guesses not that much uh, like you will lose one by third of that mark so i used to avoid that of putting a question which i am not completely sure okay after the prelims exam is over mains part so in the mains conventional questions are there how you practiced the conventional papers sir when i wrote a uh, esc uh, in 2022 Yes. i was not able to prepare for esc mains test means i didn't give any test series in that and that was my biggest mistake oh. uh, because of that paper one i was not able to write pr- properly so same mistake i rectify in 2023 means that i started giving test series i didn't skip a single test series in that i attended all the test series because answer because uh, mains paper is too lengthy 
you 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 don't know how much you have to write how much you have to control that thing i was uh, not sure in 2022 esc main so uh, giving test series is very important and uh, i have given test series uh, like all and uh, i have analyzed my performance and where i can cut uh, where i can save my time so i have done analysis on that oh, what about the service subjects like basic electrical engineering and computer architecture etc what was uh, computer uh, computer architecture was part of my curriculum in to in my btech so that was i was comfortable in that but uh, basic electrical i was not uh, so much comfortable in that so i have prepared transformer part and uh, some of the dc machine part because those questions were easy induction machine and uh, uh, other other topic i have skipped like uh, okay so coming yeah. to the interview part so in the interview board how much time you have spent sir it was around uh, 25 minute time and uh, um, uh, there uh, one person was there from drdo and i am selected in uh, as scientist in drdo i didn't join yet the joining is not yet come so my miss he uh, he has uh, set the tone for me like he was more uh, question was related to drdo defense activities what are the their technologies they are using and after that they have asked what are your favorite subject and after that interview went very smoothly for me so it was like good luck for me that the interview was pretty much normal for me okay any questions on current affairs uh yes uh, chairperson ma'am ask about what are the means i am i am from uttar pradesh so she was asking about the new uh, new policy uh, yogi government is making for the development of bundelkhand area like what are the initiatives they are taking and one more question was related to green energy uh, what are the green energies used by railways so this they were mostly application related questions okay. and some current related questions on hobbies and no question from uh, of uh, from hobby on a personal uh, data like a place of study occupation of the father nothing no nothing nothing okay in no in the technical uh, any questions on technical subjects yes there were plenty means most of my interview was uh, technical related only they have Which asked they asked Uh, they ask me favorites can you tell your favorite subjects so i have said uh, network communication analog so most of the question were from these three subjects only a simple questions or any very no basic. sir they started with basic question then they started going deep in that acha based like on their performance yes 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 they have designed some circuits and based on that they were uh, asking me questions okay okay mr rajesh uh honestly speaking you have completed your graduation 2018 yes sir now cleared in 2023 yes sir in between you worked already in some other companies okay yes sir yes suppose a college going student is there third year or final year student he yes, wants to crack this exam in the very first attempt yes sir What's your suggestion sir it is a uh, pretty much means oh, i have uh, gave a uh, four year gap in that because i didn't have uh, any plan of uh, yeah. clearing esc before that i had because working. of the because of the corona and the work culture it changed because of that i have changed my mind of shifting okay. to government sector and mm. uh, I, it, for me if i count like i have given 9 to 10 months completely for this preparation and i was able to complete that and uh, in gate also i have got 81 rank and okay. means i was able to clear all the things whatever was there in line so uh-huh. uh, my suggestion will be there uh, follow the coaching whatever the guideline they are giving because uh, they will make our job easy for us because uh, in btec syllabus is pretty much lengthy so you can't uh, go to standard books and read everything yeah. if you have that that was time you can do it like if you are starting from your college first year then you have that time that you can study a standard book pro- properly one by one and you can make your own notes in that but if you are pre- starting preparing in third year or fourth year then it is good you should take a help of the coaching because it it literally helped me in uh, clearing that uh, exam uh, like in faster way and easily because so Any many things general are- motivation you can general motivation to juniors <laughs> you are learning from your life 
जनरल मोटिवेशन आई कैन से कीप वर्किंग हार्ड यू विल डेफिनेटली अचीव सक्सेस बिकॉज आई आई ऑल्सो बिलोंग फ्रॉम वेरी मिडिल क्लास और लोअर मिडिल क्लास फैमिली वॉट एवर आई हैव अचीव इन माई लाइफ दैट इज बिकॉज ऑफ माई हार्ड वर्क एंड माई पेरेंट्स सपोर्ट इन दैट सो सेम थिंग आई विल कन्वे टू मर जूनियर कीप वर्किंग हार्ड डेफिनेटली यू विल गेट सक्सेस देर नो फॉर हार्ड वर्क फॉर दैट Yes, no yes, sir. There is no, no substitute for hard work. No, yes, sir. There is no shortcut in the life. If you take shortcut, you will fall definitely. If not today, if, tomorrow. Yes, sir. Definitely, you will achieve Raj. some small Raj. success. But great, Rajesh ji. Ah, uh, thank you once again. Congratulations. Convey our pranams to your parents. Thank okay, you. Okay, sir. Thank you. Otherwise, thank you. God bless you. God bless you. Okay, sir. Thank you so much.